Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Shanti. So today I'm going to be decluttering and organizing my kitchen cabinets. As you can see, it's in dire need of some attention. So if you're in need of some motivation to get up and get some things done around your house, let's do this together. Okay guys, so I went out to my storage and I always have a surplus of bins and things like that. I'm not sure if I'm going to be using these, but I think, uh, hopefully, hopefully I am. Okay, so let's come over here. The reason why I'm hesitant on using them is because I have some white bins here, some blue here, and then I'll be adding gray that kind of, I don't know, I just don't like that. But one day I probably would change it all over, you know, to one color, but I'm just trying to use what I have on hand right now. Yeah. He doesn't mind at all. He won't mind you a second. He does whatever while he feels for nobody but himself. No, yeah. He doesn't mind at all. He won't mind you a second. He does whatever while he feels for nobody but himself. No, yeah. So I pull myself together. Myself the pressure here I was trying my best to find the expiration date on this bottle of barbecue sauce right when I was about to give up I found it like dang Okay, so this is ridiculous. I already have this much trash just from cleaning out that one cabinet. Okay, y'all, I have these food warmers because we host a lot of different events and I cook for each of them, so it re they really come in handy. I keep them in boxes because I just feel like it helps me to keep them in good condition. Also, I just wanted to say thank you to each of you who watch my videos and support me. I really appreciate each and every one of you. Okay guys, so I have finished with this area. I have to say, since we purchased this home almost five years ago, this has never been this functional. It's been close, but but not this functional. So let me show you guys something I'm embarrassed of. These are all the canned and box items that were expired. And what I have a problem with is I'll make a list without necessarily checking my cabinet. I'll make a list of what I'm going to be making for 
the month and I'll buy a surplus I'll, I'll buy the items that I need to make what you know whatever dinner item I'm making instead of going to my cabinet like I know best look at that trash this is uh, I can't even put nothing else in here because my husband is the one that takes this out and he's gonna look at me like I'm crazy but um, nevertheless, I have to get back in the habit of actually looking in my cabinets before I make a list because otherwise I'll just buy new items and I'll use those items as opposed to checking the cabinet like I should. And this is just, this is actually just a waste. It's awful. I'm not proud of this and I will be, I won't be doing this again. But nevertheless, this are, these are all the items that were expired. So right here before I had um, like paper goods, napkins and things like that, I decided that really wasn't functional. It didn't really make sense. So what I did was I put all of the paper goods down here. That way I know exactly where to go to if I need to see if we have forks, you know, napkins, um, Ziploc bags, whatever the case may be. And then right here in this cabinet is basically where I keep my surplus items and I think that makes more sense. And then I've never actually had a basket or a bin for potatoes so I'm going to start doing that. So right here as you can see I literally have no box items but I never have a ton of them anyway. So basically what I try to do is organize these by specific items. So this is where I'll keep all my beans. This will be tomato based items. These will be where I keep the soups. And then down here is where I'll keep the like cream of chicken, cream of mushroom, since I use those a lot. And then back here is where I keep my extra canned goods. And basically just to cover that up, I have these two pretty containers in front. Just don't get enough from me. Just don't get enough from me. Worry way too much, got a policy. Didn't bring me luck, just the honesty Now it's all on me, if I'm gonna win Oh, I'm just gonna get up It rains down on me All the phone calls I'm ignoring, see I'm a mess, just trying to guess my way through this Just don't get enough from me So here is everything, all the glasses that I took down from the cabinets. This area over here, I'm not sure why I had some medicine. Actually, I do. It was just convenience. But nevertheless, these are all the glasses that I will not be keeping, that I'll be donating because we never use these and I don't care for them anymore. These are the glasses. We don't really use glasses, you guys. My husband is actually the only person who actually uses the glasses. But uh, nevertheless these wine glasses and these two glasses were used recently I just washed them so I don't have to wash those these are all the glasses that I'm gonna be keeping but I'm going to be washing as well because some of them are a little dusty
string on me The way you make me feel is crazy How did you get so fly? You got me like Okay, so moving over here to these cabinets. I don't need to do anything to this cabinet because I always stay on top of this one. Same with this cabinet, it's organized so I don't need to touch it. But this one here needs some love. I don't even know what's going on at the bottom but we're about to get that together right now. So fly, you got me like my, my, my You got me like my, my, my You got me like There's no other than you now, babe Nah, 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 cause you got me like My, my, my Like, oh my So here are all the cups, tumblers, and mugs that I'm going to be getting rid of. You guys, it's amazing, um, you know, when you go through your items, it's amazing what you realize that you never use or that is damaged. Like this is a lot. Okay, so this cabinet is organized too, you guys, it just has my seasoning. so. Um, I keep that organized because I cook a lot, so it has to stay organized. And then this cabinet, I just have my crock pot, so there's nothing really in there. And then I just keep all of my candles, my candle warmers, and my wax warmers in here. So this is organized as well. So the last cabinet we have to organize is this one here. Always knew that you were stubborn, but didn't know it'd be so hard to figure out who you really are. I guess our dreams fell asleep. There's no passion in the comatose. Baby, going down, 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 down. Baby, going down, 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 down. Tried so hard to stay afloat. Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. And I thought. I am so over this glass table. We've had it for years. It doesn't really go with my kitchen and I just don't like how you can see every little fingerprint. With that being said, I've been searching for one that I love. Hopefully I find it soon so I can get rid of this one.
Honestly, guys, I just wanted to give you an up-close look. Um, sometimes it's hard to pick up things on the camera. But look, this cabinet has been cleaned. And it's super, um, I don't know, it's just super, like, kind of squeaky and clean. When you put the scrubbing bubbles on the cabinets, it literally picks up all the grime, the dirt, the dust, and it does this. Like, this is absolutely disgusting, but clearly just much needed so if you have cabinets that because you know how grease just like builds up on them and they're really sticky and you try your best to wipe it down I promise you you'll thank me later if you spray the scrubbing bubbles on here and then clean it with a hot rag FYI after I clean each cabinet I rinse the towel off in hot water and then I put it in the bleach water that was in the sink I didn't film that part you guys also don't be like me and not use gloves because between the scrubbing bubbles and the bleach it dried my hands out and it literally took me an entire day to fully get my hands back moisturized. Set on fire. I don't know what I do without you. You make me smile. What is it that you do? My life was great till you added color. That's going to be it for today's video. I hope it motivated you guys to get up and do whatever it is you need to do around your home. If you watch this entire video, I'd love for you to put the star emoji down in the comments. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please be sure to do so. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you can know when I upload future videos. And until next time, everybody, bye! I just need you, I don't know what it is you do I just want you, I just need you I don't know what it is you do